If your Bosch display isn't turning on or isn't connecting to the motor, try these troubleshooting steps. What to do if the display won't turn on? If pressing the power button on the display doesn't turn it on, the internal battery might have lost its charge, especially if the unit hasn't been used for a while. First, insert the display into the mount and press and hold the power button for 3 seconds. If the display still doesn't turn on, find the power button on the battery. If after pressing it the battery doesn't turn on, you'll need to charge it first. If the lights on the battery turn on, it means the battery is charged. And the display should turn on automatically. If the display turns on, it's a good idea to charge its internal battery. First, remove the display from the bike. Locate the micro USB port on the side of the display, hidden under a rubber cover. Connect a micro USB cable and charge the device. If the display still doesn't turn on, check if the display is fully seated in a mount. A loose connection can prevent it from working. Inspect the contacts on the mount and the display unit. If they are dirty, clean them. Refit the display and press the battery button again. If none of this works, the internal battery inside the display unit might be dead and the unit will need to be replaced. Additional sign of a falling display battery. If the display turns from the battery power button, but the power button on the display doesn't work, this is another indication that the internal battery is failing and that the unit might need to be replaced. What to do if the display turns on but doesn't connect to the motor? If the display turns on but isn't connecting to the motor, this likely indicates a connection issue between the display unit and the system. Try the following steps. Ensure the display is fully attached to the mount by pushing the unit all the way in to make sure it's securely connected. If it still doesn't work, remove the display and clean the contacts. Check both the back of the display and the mount for dirt or corrosion. Clean them and refit the display. If that didn't help, check the mount for over-tightening. If the handlebar has an unusual shape, an over-tightened mount can slightly bend. That weakens the contact between the display and the mount. Loosen the bolt slightly just enough so the mount can move with a small amount of force. If the problem still isn't resolved and you have access to another Bosch display, such as from a friend or relative's bike, swap the display units to check if the issue is with the display itself or the mount. If the second display also fails to connect, the mount might be faulty and might need to be replaced. At this point, if none of these steps work, it's a good idea to visit a Bosch certified dealer for further diagnosis. Thanks for watching. I'd love to hear if you found this video helpful, so feel free to leave a comment. I truly appreciate all your support in helping this channel grow. Thanks so much for your subscriptions, likes, comments, and for sharing my videos with your friends on social media and forums. If you'd like to support the channel even more, consider becoming a member for some great perks. Just click the Become a Member icon on the screen to learn more. Thanks very much, and I'll see you again very soon.